The power of speech can go a long way in making or breaking a relationship. Assalamu alaikum. My name is Ahmed Gokul. I will be sharing my reflection for the Active Intadar campaign this week, inshallah. 2020 was a year which I feel was devoid of hope. Now, more than ever, I feel that we are awaiting our Holy Imam, Ajallahu Fadija Sharif, in a way perhaps we haven't before. The burning desire for hope in this world is a reason why we should not just be awaiting the Holy Imam, but actively participating in Intadar. The Socrates rule of three, is it true, is it good, and is it necessary, is a really good litmus test for you and I to assess what we do before we do it whether it's an action, whether it's something we say to someone else, but an opportunity for us to develop a habit where we think about what we do before we put it forward into the world. My second reflection for the active intadar challenge. The Socrates rule of three will allow us to think, before we spend money, could I be using this money elsewhere? Do I really need to spend this much extra on something superficial and something which is material to my life? Or could I be using these funds to help feed someone, to help give clean water to someone in need, to send a child to school in a part of the world where education is limited, or even to help people in my own postcode? My third vlog for the Active Intadar campaign. I was speaking to someone from another company who I don't feel was entirely respectful to me, wasn't really courteous um, and I thought about as many people would responding to them in a strong manner and maybe being a bit firm in the way I spoke to them but then I thought maybe I should filter that, take out any negative energy and focus on being righteous in the way I approach my speech. I feel a big part of what we need to do as a society in our own day-to-day -day interactions in our own homes is think about what we say before we say it. The power of speech can go a long way in making or breaking a relationship and making or breaking a habit and make it habitual for you to be someone who speaks truth.